Okay everyone, hello and welcome to our virtual walkthrough of the Antigua Distillery Limited's beverage bottling facility. I will be a presenter today. My name is Mario and I'm the quality coordinator for the Antigua Distillery. Alright, so here we're just going to go inside. We're going to enter our lobby and then we'll proceed directly from the lobby into our production area. It's going to be a bit noisy, so you have to bear with it. Right. So here's our production floor. And this is where we do the bottling for the water. We'll start at the beginning of the production and then we'll end up at the end. So here we have our pre-farm hopper. The pre-farm is a moldable plastic that we use to blow and convert into bottles. Here we have the machine that actually lifts up the box with the preform and then it dumps them into our hopper here. And that's what our preforms look like. To give you a closer view, it looks like this to start and after we've done our blowing it eventually becomes a bottle that looks like this. So just to show them side by side, that's our free form and it eventually becomes a bottle. So from the hopper, it then travels along this lip up into the sorter, which then sorts all the pre -forms. And it flips them right side up. They exit here. And then they run along this line into our blow molder. So the blow molder then collects the bottles and uses the UV light to heat them up, which allows them to be molded into the bottle that we want. Once it's heated, it is then flipped over and then it enters into the blow molding machine. So the blow molder picks up the preform from the right hand side and it then flips them over into the blow mold itself. You'll hear that pounding noise, that is the bottles being blown and then they exit on the left of the machine. Where they come out as fully blown bottles. The bottles are then loaded into our filler where they are filled with the Oasis water. So you see the bottles being loaded here, they enter the filler on the left, empty, and then they exit the filler on the right, filled with water. After they are filled, they are then capped by our copper. Again you have the filled bottles being entered on the right and then exiting on the left. Here is our copper, copper. This does the same thing as the preform copper. It just takes the cover up via the conveyor. It is then sorted via the sorters. And then it shifts along the line here. Into the filler to be attached to the bottle. So the bottles 
exit the filler here and then they run along our conveyor to continue the process of labeling, packaging and packing. So you see here we have bottles coming out and then once they pass this machine here the bottles are then coded with specific lot numbers for the day's production. So the bottles are then run into our labeler where the labels are attached. So you'll see the bottles come in on the left. Then they are run through the labeler and they exit with the label on the right. In the background, we have our labeling machine, which unravels the labels via a series of gears and clockwork mechanisms, and then untangles it so that it's straight and right side up. It is then fed into the labeler, where it is attached to the bottle. From here we run along our conveyor into our accumulation table and then into our shrink wrap machine. So here we have the bottles being accumulated, then they are organized so that they can fit neatly in a case. For this specific product, there are 24 bottles to a clay. So you'll see here, the bottles are aligned, counted, sorted, and then transferred. From here, they travel down into our heat tunnel where it's wrapped with shrink plastic. And then it enters into the tunnel. So after the tunnel, the exit looking like this. And then they're sent down into our packing area where they are loaded onto pallets. And that is a quick walkthrough of our bottling process at the Antigua Distillery Beverage Bottling Plant. Thank you for taking your time out for listening and we hope you've enjoyed your tour.